Scientists in Israel say they've discovered a previously unknown form of early human after studying fragments of a fossilized skull and jawbone. They were found at an archaeological site near Tel Aviv. It's thought they could explain genetic links between modern humans and Neanderthals. The BBC's Tim Ullman has the story. Isn't it amazing how something so small can be so significant? A skull fragment is analysed by scientists in Tel Aviv, but this is no ordinary skull fragment. Along with part of a jawbone, it was unearthed at Nesha Ramla, an archaeological site once used by a cement plant. And they may well answer questions about the development of human life on Earth. Nesha Ramle findings are the missing piece in the puzzle that can help us explain open questions in human evolutionary history and can uh, uh, give us an uh, indication of the origin, the source population of Neanderthals who lived later in Europe. It's believed that Neanderthals, the cousins of modern humans, died out around 40,000 years ago. But these fragments are from a species much older than that and suggest the Neanderthal story may be a lot different to what we previously imagined. Now we can say that it's probably that they originate uh, in, in, in the Levant, in our region, rather than in Europe, as uh, many uh, researchers thought uh, until now. Nesha Ramla may have lived alongside and even mated with Homo sapiens for more than 100,000 years. These aren't just fragments of bone. They are pieces of an evolutionary jigsaw. Tim Allman, BBC News.